Hi guys, um, so today we're going to be talking about saving and some of the really cool financial technology products that are on the market now that help us tackle that pain point. So personally, I'm usually typically a really good saver, but I found that in the last you know year or so, like first my net worth took a big hit, second, um, I went from paid employment to becoming an entrepreneur and I'm probably a little bit poorer, you know, than I should be. So I find that when you have less, so when you go through those like changes in life, those financial changes, your living expenses stay the same or keep going up and your earning power has come, you know, down, it becomes slightly trickier to save we start telling ourselves all these lies about oh i don't have any money so i can't save or i don't earn enough or you know the bills are just piling up how do you expect me to save but they're just lies that we tell ourselves so i've been personally really excited about um some of the financial um technology products that are coming on the market um at the moment and one of my friends Olumide Shoyombo, he was like, I said, I just invested in this new um, financial technology product called Piggy Bank, and I think that you love it. And I was like, eh, yes, keep selling your market. But I have Josh <laughs> here, who is one of the co founders of PiggyBank.ng, who is actually going to put me through how Piggy Bank works and if it can actually do anything for you know me reaching my savings goals. So, hi, Josh. Hi. <laughs> nice to meet you. Thank you. Nice to meet you too. Yeah. Um, so come and tell me how Piggy Bank works. What is Piggy Bank? Okay, so uh, Piggy Bank is a, sim is a simple personal finance management app that helps mm. people save little amounts of money daily, weekly, or monthly, automatically yeah. from their using their debit cards. Okay, you know, saving towards a specific savings target. Uh, it's very very simple to use. All you need to do is log onto the app piggybank.ng. Uh, you get started with your email address and phone number and then you enter um, you save your first hundred there as you add your card details then uh, once you're done with that you add your um, withdrawal account okay. where you want the funds to be to sent to back be sent to, to when you reach your goal you, yeah anytime you want to withdraw when you reach your goal and then you create a convenient savings plan okay that's quite interesting as it but let's actually just break this down using an example so for example um, this year I've really struggled with a certain pain point so i want to be able to do long long-term savings for my daughter zakora she's five um and children are already very expensive yeah so it's hard to sort of say okay do you know what i want to put money aside for her long-term savings and i want to go back to doing that um so for example i want to be able to put at least a million naira a month aside for her um this month. So if I was using piggy bank to do that or to re reach that goal, how would that work? Okay, uh, the interesting thing about piggy bank is um, you don't have to always remember to put in this amount of money every time. Okay, because it's automated. You, it's automated. Um, you just set a schedule. So for example, you're trying to save 1 million in uh, 12 months yeah. for your daughter. Um, you could spread that, um, let's say 80,000 there okay. every month. Or you could break that down into weekly to say, Really? I want to do 20,000 naira every week. <laughs> oh my god, that is so amazing. Because yeah. you know, when you hear 1 million, it sounds like a big amount exactly. of money. But when you break it down into saying, do you know what, 20k that maybe every I could have week. spent on credit and putting it aside every you week. Know, for every your week for and it. The, the, the good thing about it is you also get to choose the day of the week where you want us to debit your account. Amazing. Or you get to choose the day of the month. Let me check out this piggy bank. <laughs> yeah, well, so, for example, you could say, come debit my account on yeah. the 2nd of every month or come every it's tuesday www.piggybank.ng okay. yeah or you could split that into daily actually so you could do um mm. three thousand there every day and say okay by 2 p.m every day debit my account three thousand i love it yeah so what if there's no money in my account what if there's no twenty thousand in my account what happens? so we inform you that we made an attempt to mm -hmm. debit your account with twenty thousand and we there's insufficient funds yeah so we let you know and then we give you the option to do a quick save Okay. So whenever you have money in your account, mm. uh, you can always go back to make up for that lost week or that lost day. So it's not like you charge month. me anything no, 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 we for don't not charge having you. money. No, 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 that's, quite, that's not bad. So do you know what is um, interesting? What I want to 
I really like this website. So banks hold your money. Piggy bank helps you, makes yeah, you save. It's a clear difference. I yeah. love it. Yeah. Um, okay, so I opened my a, a piggy bank wallet by just putting my email address. Yeah, so you sign up using your mm. email address, phone number. And my card right? details. The next step will be to enter your card details. Um, okay. To ask you for your um, um, card number, um, your expiry date, and your PIN. The reason why we're asking for your PIN is to actually verify that you're using your own card. Okay, not someone else's. Exactly, for for, okay. for, them, for, for them people. So, um, okay. it's after, when, once you put in your PIN, it sends you a token. Mm. So the phone number connected to your bank account. Okay. So it checks, does like real proper verification, proper verification to ensure that you are using your own card. And also it's advisable for people who have MasterCards. Mm -hmm. It works very well with MasterCards from Amazing. any bank. Yeah. Amazing. So so I get it. It's easy. It takes maybe like two to ten two minutes, minutes like to oh. sign up for a piggy bank account. So it's, it's easy. But what I'm interested in is... Um, what's the return on this on this savings <laughs> account because you know typically mm -hmm. lots of people complain about the fact that you know banks you know when you're getting a loan mm -hmm. the interest is very high but when mm -hmm. you're saving like it's so small like yeah. you're almost getting nothing so what kind of are your rates sort of competitive yeah so um first of all i, I like to point out that um there are no charges mm -hmm. for transferring money from your bank account your mm. piggy bank account, account whatsoever um, piggy bank also adds six percent annually so okay. it's spread 1.5 percent every quarter per, so okay. there are fixed interest days and there are okay. also fixed withdrawal days so for example on um, the 30th of march 31st of march rather is a withdrawal day and then mm. the first of april is an interest day okay. so if your savings plan is still active on the first yeah. it checks your account to see the balance you have and mm. adds 1.5 percent sure. off your balance to That's your amazing. savings that's amazing. Six percent is actually pretty good in terms of returns, especially because it's just it's just a savings um, yeah. um, product. Because I was just talking to my account officer today about saving for Zocora, and I wanted mm. to know what the rates you know were, uh, and is is <laughs> is what between zero and or I don't know one naira and ten million naira you okay. get four point five percent, which is at least mm -hmm. is smaller than mm -hmm. you know what mm -hmm. you're offering and above 10 million you get 5.5 percent to six yeah. percent so basically if we're comparing the two if i put i need 10 million naira to be able to get to the six percent yeah. that you are giving and you can start with any amount right yeah so we're, we're trying to make it very easy, easy for everybody for so everyone. for example daily savers can save between 15 naira and mm. 10 thousand naira every day so 10 thousand is the max 15 naira is the lowest you okay. can do weekly um savers can save at least 1000 naira every week and at most 50,000 there mm. while monthly savers can save at least 5,000 okay. and at most 200,000. Okay. So there's also for big things then. You can build it up. So we also have the quick save mm. Mm. feature that allows you add uh, manually deposit money. So you can have up to 5 million in your piggy bank account okay. or more. So as long as you keep building it up and then you're saving, putting in something every month, there are no limits to what mm. you can have in your piggy bank account. So what about what about um, early withdrawals? So I'm saving mm -hmm. for Zucor, I'm putting this 20k a week every um, every week and then maybe something comes up like, like my landlord sends me a service charge bill I was not expecting and I need to take you yeah. know money out of it. So we made, Would you charge me for it? Yeah, we made provision for that. It's called an early withdrawal fee. Mm -hmm. So we charge you 5% on whatever you're withdrawing. I, li I like that. I think that that's fair because on one hand, I don't want to have to touch that's my it. savings. Exactly. Like I want it to be for, I want to put the money aside for what I put it aside for. Sure. So I think when you think about that 5%, like a um, discipline. Exactly. Mm -hmm. You think, hmm, do I really want to lose 5% on exactly. this money that I've worked so hard, so hard for. to put aside? I like that. So there are no charges, but there are withdrawal fees if you're naughty yeah. and you want to put your hand in so the we have bag. Four, we have four fixed withdrawal days every year. 31st okay. of March, 30th of June, 30th of September, and 31st of December. On mm. those days, if you withdraw, it's free. Yeah. Anything outside those days, we charge you 5%. And again, similar to banks, because with banks, you, your savings account, for you to actually get the 4.5% interest, you have, you have there's yeah. a limit, you yeah. know, for how many times you can withdraw, you know, the money. I really like this app. Um, okay. So because my mind is always, you know, working and thinking about the business model for this, yeah. right? Um, first of all, how do you make money? Like, so if the bank is, if a bank is 
only able to give me 4.5 percent how come you're able to give me six okay how um, does it work you're not just a good samaritan that's <laughs> just like oh yes let's help our save our money <laughs> so first of all um and piggy bank works directly with financial institutions to help warehouse these okay. funds so currently we're working with uba um funds are currently held up in uba, UBA. so all the all the monies you're saving mm. it's been held securely there um uh, while our costs are relatively low, low right because the system is automated we don't have branches mm -hmm. we don't employ too many <laughs> staff <laughs> you know so uh we work directly with banks so, so we're, we're that's, just like a that's channel that's very that's very smart because you're bringing in more customers, more customers to the bank yeah. and um they and have a cost. float for a certain period of time that they exactly. can use so it sounds pretty safe yeah yeah i like it this app is super cool like i love it so much i'm so interested in knowing how you and somto came up with this idea like did you just think oh yes we want to do a financial technology as in a um, yeah. product for people like how did you start piggy bank like what gave you the idea okay um first of all uh we started in school so <laughs> we've been doing things since when we were in school okay um, for over seven years now uh, we, graduated, we graduated from Covenant University. Nice. Yeah, we're actually a team of six founders. Oh, wow. Yeah, great guys. That's a lot of relationships <laughs> to manage. Yeah, so, um, but we're 100% focused on piggy bank for now. And yeah. Other people are doing um, other, handling other products. So, okay. um, sometime in 2015, December precisely, um, yeah. there was something that went viral on social media. Um, although in that year we had noticed that we were very reckless <laughs> with spending. <laughs> with their spending. We just moved into a new apartment and yeah, all the costs that come with it, you know, buying stuff. So mm. it was horrible. Expensive. You know, at the end of the year you're like, okay, what I've happened? I've been working, but where did my money go? <laughs> where is everything? And then there was a picture of someone who had saved up three hundred and sixty five thousand dollars from, from putting one thousand there every day and it went viral and everyone wanted everyone picked up the challenge. Yeah. Okay, let's do this one K challenge. And people started selling saving boxes on mm. Twitter. It the was colo, going viral. It's exactly. Colo, the colo I mean, thing, yeah. yeah. So I ordered one actually. <laughs> <laughs> Two thousand there for what? Yeah, so uh, but I had a discussion with um Sunto. And we decided to do something about it. Like how do we automate to, this? How do we automate yeah. this and make it easier? Because I didn't want to have to remember to put in that 1,000 there every day because sometimes I might forget. Mm -hmm. Or oh, one day I can actually just break the box. And when, once I break the box, that's it's the end. It's done, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, there goes my year saving. So we wanted something that is very strict and uh, that will actually help us save. Yeah. So we came up uh, with Piggy Bank within a few weeks. And uh, we started telling our friends. We're using it personally for yeah. about two months you know then we told some of our friends we actually approached the people who were actually selling these boxes on twitter <laughs> like, are you interested in this new <laughs> yeah, yeah, like exactly. automated way of doing and it and they were so excited because it was so easy yeah. you don't have to do anything as long as you have an atm card a mastercard it works mm -hmm. perfectly you sign up and then you're already saving so um it started that way and then it just started going viral i mean like what we've basically we're at almost 10,000 users mm. currently and it's strictly word of mouth a lot That's of people amazing. telling people in what period of time um so we launched in uh, officially april 2016 you're kidding so in yeah. like a year you yeah. basically you have 10,000 yeah. users without any major marketing that is so so yeah. so crazy so 10,000 people are saving guys what are you doing with your money like i am personally even if i do this personal finance stuff like i'm personally like chuffed by the fact that you know how easy it is to sort of like use this app i'm definitely going to use it for one of my you know one of my goals but josh and somto they came with a presents for us so the first 100 people was it 100 or 200? 200 the first see they're so generous the first 200 people that use the code smart money um to register for the app will get a thousand naira extra to add to their savings how cool is that yeah. so you get it at the end of the month um you know when you start you know saving so the first 200 people guys i'm imagining that a lot of people are want to go, going to want to take advantage of this um thing so you guys should hurry up and go and do it so that you can benefit from it trust me a thousand naira can do a lot um thank you so much josh i Thanks think that lot. this was so helpful i wish you so much luck i love the fact that um you know this is true entrepreneurship you see yeah. a pain point in the market something that has affected you and your friends That's personally funny. and you go out and look for a solution um to that problem so if you're using piggy bank or if you're thinking of using it or if you enjoyed this episode 
give us a shout on instagram leave comments um below the video and you know let us know what you think let us know what your own experiences are and what you think that you know they should add to the app to make it better bye